Hi V. All right, uh, let's start the tutorial by um, teaching you how to use your uh, new email address. So you, you have now an email address uh, named info at neurachnails.ca. So to get there, you just, you just um, type in neurachnails.ca slash webmail. That's to access your um, email through the web. This is why it is called webmail. So you just type in your uh, email address and the password I'll give you in the, in the password sheets and just log in. And here you have three ways of reading your email, uh, Horde, Roundcube or Square Mail. I would, I would recommend using Roundcube, that's the, I mean, the, the easiest way of doing it. Uh, it's the most intuitive interface. So just click on read email using Roundcube. And now you access your webmail here. So obviously here there's no messages yet because I've just created the uh, the email address. Uh, before it was just an alias, meaning it was just forwarded to your personal email. So the only thing you have to do is uh, like reply. You can compose an email from there. When you click on the inbox, you will see your the email received right there. So it's a uh, pretty straightforward. Um, just want to show you something else. If I'm logging out and logging back in, here there's a mail client. That's how you're gonna use. Uh, what you're gonna use to configure your iPhones or your Mac or your uh, Windows-based uh, PC. Um, if you want to use Outlook, for example, that's what you want to click on. If you click on this. Then you will see the uh, all you need to do here, all the required settings for your email clients. So the incoming server, outgoing server, uh, username, and of course the password is still the one I'm I'm gonna email to you. So um, that's it for your email address. Very simple. Uh, if you want to set up the iPhone, use this. Uh, it's gonna help you out. And other than that, just to give me a call if you have any questions.